Hey everybody, I have something to show you guys. This is called Operation Harsh Doorstop. It is a game that has been in development for quite a while. I haven't really played this game a whole lot, but from what I can see so far, it is absolutely amazing. We are playing with World War One. USA and Germany. Oh crap, I'm gonna die. Oh crap. As you can see, we are playing with AI bots right now because I didn't wanna. I died. I didn't really wanna put myself into a position where. I would kind of screw up and make somebody else angry online. So it looks like right now we are just kind of trying to battle in the trenches and push ahead to the next the next point. The game is absolutely amazing so far and I'm actually having a freaking blast some reason though it doesn't seem to run the best on my hardware which is kind of kind of sad because it is a very 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 good game it was built by people who actually know the games who know what gamers actually want but I'm sure that it will be fixed at a later date I'm sure more weapons will be added as well Oh crap. I haven't had to aim with a mouse and keyboard in a whole long time. <laughs> Leave me alone. I don't know where he went and I'm afraid to move. Good. Get down the hole. I will say the bots are extremely fun to play against. The animations are beautifully done. Ah, oh, crap. Good, you die. Crap, reload. It really makes you okay. That's that's kind of cool. I've never had a game that you could actually reload down the sights with a bolt action like that. <laughs> I don't really know if there is a way to heal in this yet. Like I said, this is my first uh, first game out playing it. And honestly, I probably shouldn't be... Oh god, this is running like dog water. Yep, I died. It looks like I'm only able to spawn with one one weapon at the time at the moment. I don't really know why that is. I'm not sure if that's just the way the way that it's going to be. But it looks like is it friendly fire? Oh my god. 
I can't tell if this friendly fire if I'm just missing him. Jump. I really don't know what's up with my, uh... Performance here, it is not very good though. Let's see. Maybe I'll do that and try it. See if that comes out a little bit better. Nope. Still getting 35 frames a second. These animations are beautifully done. Whoop. It's like whack a mole. <laughs> Can you hit me? Yep, so I can hit him, but that doesn't do anything. Hey. <laughs> Watch your profanity. Good. I don't think I can pick up any other extra weapons. Nope. I like how whenever you actually reload too, you can see the little bolt in the bottom right. When he actually reloads it, he actually... It goes back like it does in Battlefield 1. I just I enjoy this way more than I do Battlefield. This feels like an actual... Well done game and not just... A money grab. I will hunt you down. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Kill it. I can't shoot. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I don't know how to heal. Yeah, I do. Okay. Never mind. That was a grenade. <laughs> so we pushed the front lines. It looks like I've pressed, pushed the front lines up a little bit ahead. I don't know why this is the only spot that I can spawn in at. I don't know if it's, I don't know if that's by design or what, but this is fun. And this is very fun. I don't think these are exactly World War One weapons, but I know this is a World War One setting. And I could see something like this with other players being absolutely frantic. There is a stamina meter, as you see in the bottom left. How do I throw this? Please don't kill me. One, two, three. Okay. Stop being good shots. <laughs> That's a grenade. Can I do anything? Like, can I make the front line go further? Die. I will say this is extremely, extremely difficult. It's very rare that I come across an actual... AI that I can defeat. <laughs> it's hard to hit them with something like this. Huh, I can't jump over that. Huh, okay. Looks like a crater here. That is very minimalistic as well. Absolutely love it. 
I love that you can't just sit there and swan dive. One little criticism that I have. You stand up and and go prone way too fast. I do enjoy this a lot though. No, I'm gonna run to the next one. Let's keep stand up and run. Need to go ahead and reload this real quick. Oop. <laughs> oh I suck at aiming. There is a clamber ability. This is really well done. I'm gonna get a grenade kill. Another grenade! Go oh, crap. <laughs> As you see, I mean, they're extremely difficult. And I wonder if I could switch over to the Germany side. Die. Die, German. That's not racist, I promise. Oh yeah, these animations are so freaking beautiful. Oh. Oh, hey, I think that... Yeah, okay, so yeah, when you fire one shot... He will reload two shots because when he pulls the bolt back to reload it, he doesn't. He doesn't cover the breach with his hand. Whoop. That will set you ablaze right now. Oh, wait. Crap, 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 crap. There we go. You know what? I don't think I killed myself earlier. That is the longest fuse I've ever seen on a grenade in the game. Jump over that? No, I cannot. Oh, that's not a, that's not an enemy. I will say I don't feel like the AI is aiming specifically for me. They're just aiming in. They're aiming at us. You know, it doesn't feel like I'm fighting against the entire team against. Well, even just by myself, I guess. I love the animations in this.
I don't know if there's any objectives in the game yet, but I am really, really happy with the game so far. And I can't wait to see what they how they end up with it. No oh, crap. No <laughs> he got me. Theoretically, there should be a way for me to... There should be a way for me to uh, switch to a different weapon, but it seems like everybody else has the same weapons. I mean, there's some people like that that have... Some people. There's some bots like that that have the pistol and stuff like that, but... It seems like most of us have bolt actions like we would have in World War One. Machine gun right there, and I can't just kill him and take his weapon. <laughs> You're gonna die. But yeah, uh, so this has been... I don't know how to get out of this thing. I'm gonna go ahead and leave the game real quick. I'm gonna show you guys the UI on this too. I mean, it is really well done. I mean, I can download mod tools, mods. I can rent a server, follow the development, support us on Patreon. I mean, there's a lot of stuff you can do on this. Multiplayer, single player. I don't have the multiplayer downloaded, but I do have the standard downloaded. There's a few maps on here that are that come stock. There's training and all that. But like, for instance, if I want to go with bots, I'll come out here and I'll do... World War II Germany versus World War II USA. And I assume that the weapons will be different. Now, I did have the kit restrictions set up earlier. So, yeah, like, I mean, it's snipe rifles. I mean, it's all kinds of stuff on here. I mean, authentic World War II, World War One. Shot him in the butt. Oh, man. Yeah, I absolutely love the way this is all set up. I don't know. Can I change things? Ah, machine gunner. We'll do this one. We're going to suicide. M to respawn. We're going to come in as a machine gunner this time. This kind of show off some of his weapons. Medic. Rifleman. Rifleman should be a M1 Garand. I wonder, do I use... I'm testing something out because I'm kind of curious. Up on this. Oh yeah, it looks like I used. Well, I don't think I do. I was finding. I was trying to find out whether or not it lets you use. Uh, bipods in this and I don't think it I don't think it's set up for that just yet. But I absolutely love how this how this is. I want to go through on each of these and just kind of see how things are a little different on each of, on each of these. Thought this weapon IRL had uh who's shooting? Oh, go away. Oop. Boing. I will say one thing I hope they implement is a way to check how much ammo I have in, in a magazine. I've checked the I have checked the control settings and I don't see 
Honestly, I don't really see anything that I can change on there, you know. We're going to go back into the action real quick, see how good this thing kicks. I don't know if there's any vehicles or not yet. I'm hoping that they do implement that because this would be extremely fun. I'm probably running in the wrong freaking direction. By the way, I am sorry for the freaking 30 frames a second. I'm still going to render it out at 60. I don't think it's going to let me do 60, but I'm still going to try it. Because right now it looks... This looks horrendous. Horrible. I love how it's got both weapon reloads. Like I can I can reload while looking down the site like Well honestly like some of the new triple eight titles. Wow, there we go. Sixty frames a second. Oh, it's back down. I wanna get in the hole now. I don't wanna be up here. <laughs> I'm literally missing every single shot that I make. God, I love that reload. Whee! Uh, I want to try out the... M1 Grand. I'm just gonna mag dump on both these. Ooh, hey, we uh, unlock a new spawn point. There we go. You actually press the button to reload this, which is awesome. Which means you don't get the ping. Does it get the ping if you... Okay, so you get the thing when it does that, when you actually go through the entire mag. But even though you should get the ping there, you don't. Do a little attention to details here and there that I kind of like, though. Oh my gosh, this frame rate is horrible. Every now and then I'll jump up to 60 like it is there. But it's usually not really... I don't know, it, it's strange. It doesn't want to run at 60. I don't think it's my computer because I, I can run Metro Exodus on Ultra. So it's not it's not my, my system. Did you just... <laughs> it is a little Call of Duty thing. Check. Reload. Cats are on the side of the gun like uh, Call of Duty Big Red 1. I used to love that game growing up. Yeah, the action does get kind of hectic sometimes. But I believe this is just the beta. I don't think it's exactly... I don't think it's exactly ready yet. Whoop! You know what? That makes me wonder. Can I really do the mag, the mag tap when he rolls it and... <laughs> Taps. I love that. <laughs> kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. No. Dang it. 
Well, anyways, guys, that has been... That has been... Operation Harsh Door Stop. If I can figure out how to get out of this again. I'll see you guys on the next one. I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay. Hopefully this comes out halfway decent on the editing. I'm sorry for that. <laughs>